I just want to make some comments about this Gennady Golovkin, David Lemieux press conference. More specifically, I want to talk about some of the comments that were made by Gennady Golovkin regarding David Lemieux. Golovkin said that basically he's scared in this fight and that it's a 50-50 fight. It amazes me that so many people are taking those comments at face value. It amazes me that people are so naive that they actually believe Golovkin is being truthful with those comments and that they can't see those comments for what they actually are. Gennady Golovkin is a vastly experienced fighter. Not so much in the professional game, although he's fairly experienced now as a pro and he's been champion for a while. But as an amateur, this guy had, what, three, 400 amateur fights. He fought at the very top level. A lot of the top professionals that are around from 154 to 175, Golovkin fought them in the amateurs. We know that he sparred Kovalev, they were both trained by Angel, a Abel Sanchez earlier in Kovalev's career. And according to Abel Sanchez, and Kovalev has never denied this, Golovkin was getting the better of uh, Kovalev in sparring. So, and we know that he's been in there with Chavez Jr., Peter Quillen, and all types of other people. Big guys, guys who can punch. We know that he spars heavyweights, light heavyweights, Tavoris Cloud sparred him and whatnot. And this is when Cloud was much closer to his prime years. So this is a vastly experienced man, a man who's been in there many times with huge punches, bigger punches than David Lemieux. The idea that he would be scared is, it's a joke. Him and his trainer, I mean, his trainer's made no secret of it. His trainer thinks the fight's not gonna go four rounds and Golovkin's just gonna walk through this guy. Privately, Golovkin is thinking the same thing. I am totally convinced. He sees this as an easy fight. So why would he come out and say he's scared? Well, it's obvious. He's trying to sell tickets. Golovkin is seen by large, a uh, large proportion of the boxing public as a dominant champion and kind of a, a, a wrecking machine. A guy who goes in there and just destroys everybody. And it's getting to the point now where people are thinking, you know what? Who can actually challenge this guy? And people are expecting him to win easy every time he goes in the ring now. And that is not the greatest thing in terms of selling tickets. People want to see competitive fights. And this is Golovkin's first pay-per-view. So there's even more pressure on him to make sure that he sells not only tickets for the arena, but also pay-per-view buys. So he don't want the public thinking this, this is a mismatch or this is going to be an easy fight. He wants the public to think that this is going to be difficult for him. So he's coming out and saying, oh, I'm scared. It's a 50-50 fight. And for those of you who don't know, Golovkin is signed to K2 Promotions, which is the Klitschko promotion outfit. And if you've watched the Klitschko's over the past 10 years or so, Vitaly and Vladimir, you will have noticed that during some of their press conferences before some of their fights, particularly when they're fighting lower quality opposition, both of them have come out many times and said things similar to what Golovkin said about their opponents. Both Klitschko's had come out before previous fights, you know, in, in the initial press conference to announce the fight and said, oh, I don't know who's going to win. We'll have to decide on the night. This is a dangerous fight. Don't know who's going to win. I can't say, only God can say, and all this kind of stuff. The Klitschko's have said that. So when I heard Golovkin say it, I was like, the Klitschko's or Tom Lofla or someone from K2 has put him up to saying, making these comments. Because this is what the Klitschko's do. Now Golovkin's doing it. He's signed to the same promotional outfit. The idea that he's scared of Lemieux, I mean, how naive are some people. It, 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 it's, it shocks me that people actually believe he's scared. The only danger in this fight is not Golovkin being scared of Lemieux. The danger for Golovkin is that he underestimates Lemieux. Because as I said, Abel Sanchez thinks this is an easy fight 
And privately, I'm convinced Golovkin thinks this is a four or five round blowout. And I think it probably will be as well. Lemieux's got punching power and he may be the biggest puncher that Golovkin's faced as a professional. But other than that, Lemieux don't really bring that much to the table from what I can see. And I've watched quite a lot of Lemieux's fights. And I'll get into more of the boxing style matchup side of this fight in a later video. And I've done it in a previous video, but I'll talk about that more in another video. But in this video, I just wanted to talk about, like I say, the press conference and these comments from Golovkin. It amazes me how naive people are thinking that Golovkin really means those comments. <laughs> he can't see that he's just trying to sell tickets. People, please, please. This guy is vastly experienced. Been in there with top pros, sparring heavyweights, sparring light heavyweights, sparring cover. I mean, come on, people. Scared of Lemieux? Seriously? He's trying to sell pay-per-views. <laughs> That's all it is. So, yeah, those of you who are not naive, I'm sure there are still incredibly naive people who are going to try and say in the comments, Hatman, you're wrong. He is scared. <laughs> There's no hope for you people if you really believe that. <laughs> but I know some of you are going to say that in the comments. There's really no hope for you. <laughs> it never ceases to amaze me how naive human beings can be. But uh, yeah, drop your comments in the comment section below. It's Hatman, I'm out.